New Chelsea owners must try to secure 83 million passing transfer to solve Thomas Tuchel's midfield problems. Prospective Chelsea owners must make it their first priority to reignite interest in Aurelien Tomini following the Blues' defeat to Real Madrid. Thomas Tuchel's side were overrun in midfield as Los Blancos swolved back to Santiago Bernabeu with a 3 com one advantage with Angolo Kante hooked at halftime. Tony Cruz, Luca Modric and Casemiro schooled Kante and Giorgino as they patrolled Sanford Bridge. Even with the help of Matthew Kovacic off the bench at halftime, the West Londoners struggled to wriggle from the Spanish giants' grasp. Chelsea's inability to grab the bull by the horns and steer the momentum in their favour quickly proved an issue for Duchel. Real Madrid enjoyed a majority of possession and were far more authoritative with their passing. The stability and structure that Cruz, Modric and Casemiro brought to Carlo Ancelotti's side opened greater avenues of attack for the creative forces in their team. The Spanish side made over five times as many passes into the attacking third and four times as many passes into key areas as Chelsea, UEFA report. Real Madrid showed two shells midfield how to marshal a game at the highest level, which left Blues fans crying out for the Germany's arrival at the end of the season. Chelsea fans took the Twitter to stress the severity of the club's frail teeth. However, while many might be keen for prospective Chelsea owners to make Germany the club's main and signing of a new era, Real Madrid have overtaken the Blues in a race to sign the Monaco midfielder according to Daily Telegraph. The Chelsea Eriki opted against signing the 22-year-old in the summer because they felt as if they could have done with another 12 months of development, say the Athletic. To Shell's side have since paid a price for their naivety and reluctance to sign as somebody who has been identified as the perfect Casemiro replacement. Having already lost a midfield battle to Real Madrid, Chelsea looked to do so again, but this time in the boardroom. The world champions now look as if they have a fair distance to make up before they can rival Los Blancos for the 83 million passing rated midfielder, despite having once led the race. A blanket of uncertainty has now been thrown over two shells midfield. Both Giorgino and Kante see that contracts expire in June 2023, so by losing out of Germany, Chelsea could have missed a trick.